guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here feel free to subscribe to get more educational videos like this one on my past video i was talking about how to create a bootable flash drive but on this one i'm going to show you how to unlock your modem without any pin so stay tuned and let's meet after this intro Another thing, if you are a forex trader and you want to learn more about forex, you can visit this channel for more information. Also, you can visit this channel for more entertainment, personal stories, vlogs, and lifestyle. I bet you would like it. My modem was using MTN network only. Now I can use all network without any errors or malfunctions. I'm using Huawei 3G mobile broadband modem. Hmm, you might be asking yourself, will this trick work on my modem? Yes, it will work. Just follow every step I take and you will be sorted. So, let's jump to our PC. So now as you can see, the modem's profile name is written MTN. So, now you are going to look for a tools option. So on top here so as you can see I found my tools option so you're gonna look for you gonna you gonna click it and you're gonna you're gonna click it you're gonna look for these options then now you, you are going to profile management so on this profile management there's only MTN default only so if you want to set your uh, your your modem to all network you are going to select you're going to look for this new option you click it and write and you're going to write all network all network then now you're going to go to this APN option you're going to write an restricted unrestricted unrestricted so here it's on unrestricted so on this authentication you're going you're just going to leave it just like this so now you're going to save it after you have saved it you're going to set it as default you can choose if other yeah you can you can choose if you, if you want to use mtn only or all network so i prefer this one all network so i've set my uh, my all network to default so now you're gonna click uh, okay then after you're going to exit and refresh then you're going to go uh, to this option and eject your modem eject your modem eject so you are going to remove it and insert your modem again again so let's wait for this mobile partner app to open automatically so let's wait so here it is it's opening so now it's initializing the file the device so as you can see here it's written uh it has showed uh, the signal here so this gives me a hope so now as you can see it's written w c d m a s a zero five telecom roaming so we are going to go back to the tools again let's go to the tools again and then go to options now you this time you are going to network option so now we are going to look 
I mean, we are going to set it uh, uh, to auto search and register. Okay. Now it's written Voda Telecom. Okay, well, we are going back to that tools again. Network registration. So let's set it manually. Refresh. So now it's done guys so now it's done we are going to set it to let's see it's written it's it's, it's written uh, sa02 so now we are going to set it to we are going to set it to sa023 g then register register success so you're going to click ok so now as you can see our signal is back here it's written w c d m a s a 2 telecom sa so now as you can as you can see before we connect before we connect let's go boost our modem so you are going to go to a uh, file manager uh, right click on the local disk C go to uh, look for uh, management option I mean go to PC I mean computer uh, look for this option manage wait for the page to load so here it is so now you are going to uh, device manager then you are going to look for uh, network adapters so as you can see my network adapter is here it's on Huawei mobile connect so we are going to click it right click on it go to properties then go to advance I mean is it advanced okay now before we can connect it we are going to uh, boost our modem so go to file manager then look for computer option right click on it look for manage then wait for the page to load so you now you can go to device manager look for pods yeah go go look for pods so here are my pods on the pods option you are going to find communications pod and mobile connect so here is my modem here is my modem you are going to boost it right right click on it go to properties then go to pod settings 
then select uh, to the go to the last number here yeah it's good yeah it's good now let's turn it here then go to advance then some says uh, uh, some some modems some other modems you will find them around here on four uh, high four so now you can push it to uh, to the uh, maximum number high 14 so then click OK on this one you can do it again go to uh, properties port settings push it good now we are good you can close it so refresh then now you can connect let's test our modem if it is working so as you can see they are data loading here then go to statistics if you want to be sure uh, I can only see uh, okay on the transfer option I can only see time upload I upload I can see speed is here then download I can see the speed is here so now I'm going to open my chrome to test it so now I'm going to YouTube just to test it here it's working guys it's working guys so guys don't forget to subscribe don't forget to subscribe you don't forget to subscribe guys for more videos please subscribe please 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 subscribe like and share comment with any problem if you want me to help on the next video just comment with your problem i will see what to do so as you can see my modem is working here so i think this tutorial will help you and uh, i think you have enjoyed my video so guys thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe bye